An Armenian soldier has been killed by a sniper shot. At around 1.10 a.m. on Monday, Ashut Mikhailian, a contract serviceman of the armed forces of Armenia, sustained a fatal gunshot wound at the outpost of a military unit stationed in a northeast direction and from a sniper shot fired by the Azerbaijani army. A criminal case on charges of murder has been filed on the incident. An investigation is underway. Armenia is now ranked 21st in the number of COVID-19 deaths per 1 million inhabitants. The coronavirus death toll in Armenia has reached 711, which translates to 240 deaths per 1 million residents. A total of 37,390 COVID-19 cases are reported in Armenia thus far, and 73 new cases were confirmed in the last 24 hours, as only 314 tests were carried out on Sunday. According to the health ministry, 9,793 people are currently being treated and 26,665 others have already recovered. Also, 221 COVID-19 patients have died so far due to other diseases, and this brings the total number of deaths to 932. The applicants who were not accepted to Armenia's universities and their parents resumed their protest on Monday. They gathered in front of the Ministry of Education, Science, Culture and Sports and demanded a meeting with Minister Arai Karatunyan. The minister, however, did not come down from the minister building for a meeting, after which the protesters blocked the street across and staged a sit-in. Subsequently, a special police force apprehended several protesters who were later released. These applicants are complaining about the results of the recent university entrance exams and the new approach of the Education Department. Representatives of the youth wing of the Armenian Revolutionary Federation (ARF) Tashnaktsutyun party on Sunday held a rally in New York, expressing their protest against the Azerbaijani aggression. These young people came to the event carrying flags and posters of Armenia and Artsakh. They sang the national anthem of Armenia and Armenian national liberation songs and danced Armenian folk dances. Armenian National Squad Captain Henrik Mkhitaryan presented his personalized jerseys to the soldiers who were wounded as a result of hostilities in the northeastern part of the Armenian Azerbaijani state border in July, the Football Federation of Armenia press service reported. Also, Mkhitaryan promised to meet with these soldiers during his next visit to Armenia and to autograph these jerseys. <laughs>